Welcome back, Towners. Today we're going to make some bagel bites. Let's get it. Alright guys, start off this recipe here, we're going to take our bowl, we're going to add in uh, 4 ounces of cream cheese. Scrape off as much as I can. And we're also going to add in about a cup and a half of mozzarella cheese. Pop that in the microwave for about a minute to melt. All right, that's what it looked like out of the microwave. Now to that, we're gonna add in a cup of almond flour and two eggs. Uh, let me mix. Let me start mixing it up first. I might not need two eggs, I might just do one. That's mixing up well. Just trying to get this well combined so that the almond flour, there's no more lumps or anything in it. It's nice and cream, creamy now. Smooth, I should say, not creamy. Pliable. It's basically what we want because we're basically just going to stuff each of these. We're going to flatten this out and just put basically pieces of cream cheese inside it. And yeah, that should work right there. Alright. Alright, that's basically it. Let's start forming these balls. Uh, let me get some wax paper down. See how we're gonna do this. Let me just break off a piece. It might be too much, but let's see. Here we have some cream cheese. Let's just take a piece. That might be too much as well. <laughs> but let's, let's do a little smaller than that. Make a little ball and keep doing this. Let me spray this with some cooking spray so it won't stick to my fingers that much. That's basically it. You know I'm gonna stuff some of these with some other things, uh, other ingredients. Some, <laughs> definitely some jalapenos or something. Uh, let me try that now. Cheese in there. So 
Filipinos. Fold it over. That's gonna work. <laughs> All right, let me just continue doing this and speed this up a bit. We went ahead and sped this section up here. Uh, we were stuffing these bagel bites with cream cheese, some with cheddar cheese, and some with jalapenos, and some with a mixture of both. Alright guys, this is how they looked after we finished rolling up all of them. We got a total of four, six, um, 17 of them. Could have got a little more if I'd have made them a bit smaller, but at the end I kind of just started stuffing uh, the seasoning, the uh, cream cheese in there. Now I'm basically going to sprinkle some everything bagel seasoning over top of them and kind of roll them in there to get them over all the sides and pop them in the oven. That's it. All right, now we're basically gonna just take them and place them on a uh, grease cookie sheet to for easy cleanup. See if we can get them all on here spaced out evenly in case they open up. I'm gonna try to place them on the sheet so that I kind of know which ones have jalapenos in them or not. But if not, we just get a little spice into you. <laughs> Here we go. I'll kind of move them around a little better, but got them all spread out on here. I'll pop these in the oven at 4, 400, 425, and check them out. This is how we're looking before we go in the oven. Here we go. All right, guys, they're out of the oven. Put this tile down so I don't burn my cutting board. And this is how they look coming out. 425 for 15 minutes. And they look very nice. Browned up nice. Still hot. Cheese oozing out of some of the cheesy ones. Um, these look really good. Nice crust on the bottom of them. I don't know, I don't forgot which ones had jalapenos in them, uh, but it don't matter to me. Uh, let's release some of these up and let them cool off and then just get into one. Uh, what the heck, you know I'm impatient. Let's try this one. I see a jalapeno right there in that one, so this has jalapeno in it. Let's open it up. Ooh, it's hot. This is hot. Oh man, that's good. Tia, we got a winner. All right, guys, here are our bagel bites. These came out very nice. This one had the cream cheese in it. But nice, bready. It's good. You can stuff these with whatever you really want. Meat. Um, the everything bagel seasoning works very well. Salt, pepper, onion powder, or uh, granulated onion. 
garlic. These ain't gonna last that long. <laughs> These ain't gonna last that long at all. Definitely try these out. Stuff them with whatever you want. I did jalapenos, you know, of course I did jalapenos. Uh, cream cheese, cheddar cheese, you pepperoni, salami, whatever you want. I mean, like the, uh, I want to add the pepperonis, I mean, the jalapenos to it because my favorite ones are, uh, if you guys, uh, Auntie Annie's close to you guys, I really love their uh, jalapeno pretzels. I haven't had one in a very long time, but that was one of the reasons why I wanted to make this. But uh, try this recipe out, guys. Enjoy. All right, guys, that was our Fathead Dough Bagel Bites taste test. Uh, these came out, definitely came out great. Um, we had them stuffed with some cream cheese, some stuffed with some cheddar cheese, as well as some jalapenos. Um, definitely see myself doing this again, uh, possibly making some pizza bites out of it, stuffing it with uh, some marinara sauce and pepperonis and mozzarella cheese. Um, or even possibly making some uh, breakfast bites out of them um, with some uh, scrambled eggs and uh, breakfast sausage. A um, whole bunch of possibilities with this. But if you guys have any uh, comments or questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. And as always, thank you guys for watching. Enjoy. Enjoy. And please subscribe. Enjoy. Hey Towners, please like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the comment section. All ingredients and directions are listed in the description box below each video. And as always, thank you guys for watching.